It's an exciting day at uh, Bombardier, especially on the C-Series program. Uh, we've now completed the first uh, assembly of our uh, first uh, ground test aircraft. As you can see, the fuselage is now fully assembled and we're well on our way to uh, completing uh, the first aircraft. This aircraft, people don't realize, will go under a very extreme set of tests. Um, so it'll take it to the absolute limit of the aircraft, what it can do in maneuvers uh, during a flight, and also the most severe weather conditions you can imagine uh, this aircraft will be uh, subjected to. The structure is equipped with uh, thousands and thousands of uh, actually uh, strain gauges, parameters, and what they are for is to really measure the the strain and stress of uh, every part of the aircraft as we load it to the extreme conditions. What's unique about the C-Series is uh, we've used the absolute latest uh, material and structural technology. So for example, a fuselage is all made of advanced aluminum lithium that has advantages in strength and also in, uh, in fatigue, meaning the life of the structure and also in corrosion. So a big advantage for our customers. The assembly of the fuselage has gone flawlessly and actually we've assembled in less than uh, half the time that was planned by the program. I'm excited personally, because I've joined all the other planes. To fit this way is amazing. The fit on the, all the fuselage is very good from all the partners you have here at this time. From China, Belfast and uh, Montreal. And uh, it's an amazing experience at this time to make the C-Series. I'm very happy to work on this uh, program. We have production come down and do their joining so that the, the uh, flight test vehicle will go even faster for the fabrication. So we do all our tool proving in parallel. So this concurrent activity has never been done before. So now that the fuselage is actually complete, uh, the next step actually is to assemble the wing and also the, uh, the tail of the aircraft. And that will actually occur uh, this month. We will then go on and uh, start assembling uh, the first flight test vehicle. We call it FTV-1. So you can imagine after years of designing, planning, preparing, to actually see all the parts coming together, it's amazing. Of course there's still a lot to do, but you gotta admit, she looks pretty good, huh? <laughs>